doing some vlogging on my 2006 Cummins. So I got a flash scan, an EFI Live flash scan hooked up, and I got a splitter and an OBD Link SX. So it's the STN 1100 series chip that does the OBD2 to uh, serial. And I'm kind of giving you a rundown of how to actually do some logging with this. Or, or basically, I'm sniffing the the bus and seeing what the flash scan is actually sending for scanning. So um, this is on a Mac, and you're going to want to search for your port. Well, first off, I'm going to change directories to uh, my downloads. So ls right now, I'm in the main the root user so I'm going to change to downloads alright now you want to type in ls forward slash dev tty and I can't dot and then star and this is going to search for the ports that are available. And I have my OBD link plugged in right now. Okay. This is mine. The Bluetooth is the built in Bluetooth on the laptop. So that's what we want. So you want to copy that. Now we're going to use screen to, do, to, to open up a terminal. So you go screen. That's the port. And on mine, it's at. 115 200 baud rate okay and I forgot you wanna give it the logging flag so you go dash capital L space and hit enter and it's gonna make a log file in the downloads folder that I changed directories to so if I hit enter we should get the little arrow alright so we're going to have to set it up, so I want to make sure um, ATZ resets it, so make sure everything's cleared out. Okay, so I want to do, these are AT commands, so it's AT and then some command. That's what you type in, so we're going to do, first let's see what protocol we're on. So ATDPN gives us the protocol number, and I know I want six. Oh, hold on. Um, to make line, to have line feeds, so that way it's not piling up on top of itself. Do AT L1. Okay. And then now AT DPN. Okay, six. Uh, if you want to know what six is, go AT DP, and that'll tell you a description of it. So that's set right. If you're gonna, if you're gonna plug this into something, you don't know exactly what the the bus is, if it's CAN or if it's, uh, I forget the others, um, you want, you're going to want to set it to, you're going to go ATSP0, and what that does, if you go ATDP, ah, ATDP, that's auto, so it'll, it should auto detect. Anyway, so, I know what I want, I'm going to do a TSP set protocol six AT AT DPN. All right, we're back to six. All right, that's good. So we got that. Now okay, I set my protocol. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna allow long bytes. I don't think I need it for this, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Headers on, and then finally monitor all, and that'll listen. So we're gonna go ATAL, that's long bytes, ATH1, that turns headers on, and I think that's it. And here's the data sheet. So you can see see line feeds. 
reset. That's ATZ. Um, LL long. And your set protocol. So you can have auto N6, but I just want, I don't want auto. So if you did ATSPA N6, it would search for others N6, I guess. So I'm not really sure. This is the STN data sheet. If you go to the ELM327 data sheet, it's a little bit, it has a little bit more descriptions for these. All right, anyway, we're ready to rock. So. I want to turn line feeds off. So you go ATL0. Alright, line feeds are off. ATMA, monitor all. Alright, ready to monitor. So, I'm going to go to my flash scan. I'm going to go to scan. And actually, let me log. I'm going to log this. So that way I have something to compare it against. So, hit, hit the log button. All right, we're doing stuff, and it's going to have a buffer full. Um, I think I need a faster baud rate. But on the Mac, it's really stupid. On the Mac, it can't seem to get the baud rate to work um, higher than the 115-200. Um, I have Windows on this computer too, if I go there, I can go all the way up to 2 million. That's as far, well, 2 million 500,000, I think, is as high as I went. Um, I tried to update the driver, the FTDI driver, which is what this thing uses, and it didn't really work, so I don't know what the deal is. Anyway, to get out of this, um, you go, I'm in the dark here, control A, backslash. So, eh, control A backslash, kind of quick. And then it brings this up and you hit yes. Now you're out. So, close out of these. So here's my downloads. It made this file. Now you gotta change it to txt. Yes, use txt. Open it up and it'll have all of the info that just got pulled. Now I gotta figure out what all this means. Um, so I think from what I remember, I was looking at this a little bit earlier. The 70 zero is the ECM, and or sorry, it was the external equipment, and. All these seven eight E's are the ECM's respond response. So 